Welcome to the TLS Animator Tutorial 1. First create a prem object to insert the scripts and make your first animation. Place it the way you want. Duplicate it to have two prems or more. Insert the first script, the control script, into the root object. Now you see the waiting text above the root. Insert script one, two, three into the into all links link parts. This is most important to give the ability to move, rotate, or change the size inside the animation. So link them. After this, you're ready to animate it. Attach the HUD. After you wear it, you see it in the center of your display. And now you can follow the steps by clicking the red button. The root object will show the recording information. Bring the link frames in the first uh, position you like to use for your first frame. I only resize it for the moment. Rack, now you see you get an answer about the count of uh, frames at the moment. So, select it again, move, rotate, change size, do what you want with the preem. And after all, all preems are in the correct position, you can push the rack button again. This is a really easy way. Now you see again you have two frames. So we have built two screens inside our animation. Move it again, rotate, change size, or do something like this. Uh, I first show only the main scripts, now we have one frame more, you see this? And you can now uh, rotate something like this, uh, all you like. Um, I only show you the three main scripts to animate, or better to rotate, resize, or um, move the parts. The other scripts uh, to change the preem itself uh, are really easy. You only need to integrate them in the linked parts you like to give the ability to change from block to cube or something like this or uh, whole size, uh, text to color. All this can be done by inserting one more script into the wanted preem. Now you see I switch with the buttons through the animation and I think this is the end for the first step. Try it out, check it out and see how it 